Hi guys, in this video I'm giving away my free subscribe plugin. I was looking for a plugin like this for myself, couldn't find one for free on YouTube or on the internet, so I decided to create one myself and I'll show you how to install it and customize it to your own preferences. And uh, so yeah, you can enjoy it. So without further ado, let's dive into DaVinci Resolve. By the way, all the files are linked down below. You can download them and follow the steps on how to install it for yourself. There we are in DaVinci Resolve. You will only see my right screen. I'm using two screens, so that's why you won't see my effects library. The first step is that we're gonna add a fusion composition. Go to your effects library and under the effects tab and drag a fusion composition in. Then you, we go to fusion. You can either press uh, open in fusion here or just go to fusion. Then in the files I have attached, go to the file. There is a settings uh, file, drag it in and it will open the node map I made for you guys and uh, connect the merge 8 to MIDI out. Now we have to add a couple of files and your own profile picture to make it your own. So let's first put the thumbs up in near the node of thumbs up and the cursor as well near the cursor node and connect these oh, should align with the yellow one and here the thumbs up connect it as well and should connect to the yellow one as well now let's add our own profile picture in this case i'll use this one connect it and connect this one and then we'll see if we are further in the timeline. At the beginning you won't see it, of course, but if you're further in the timeline, you'll see that it probably doesn't really match nicely with the mask because all images are different, so we have to remask it. Click the profile pic mask and drag it on top of your face until it's nicely matched. My face is too big, so I'm gonna resize the mask until I think it's nice. Keep in mind that these width and height should be the same size in order to have a circle. So now I like it and then we have to resize it of course and put it back onto its place. Go to merge 3, drag the Y down a little bit and make it smaller like that and then it should be good for me. If you slowly drag it should be all right. Then one last thing. If you go to the template here, you can change the amount of subscribers count you have. So let's say I have, I don't know, 341k subscribers, put it in, and now uh, I have uh, a lot of subscribers. That would be nice. Uh, the font I used is Montserrat. You can change this as well. Um, up to your liking or you can download Monsterrat as well I've added in the file. Last but not least let's check the edit then you see it's very big so I'm gonna make it smaller and put it a little bit down and then we should be ready let's see. Hi guys in this video I'm giving away my free subscribe plugin I was looking for a plugin like this. So there we have it uh, you can add sound effects for clicking um, that will make it a little bit nicer so that is how you can customize my file i hope it works for you uh, if it did let me know if you like it if you want to learn how i made it please let me know it as well and i'll make a tutorial um, other than that if you have any questions or you would like me to make anything else please let me know and last but not least you know what to do and thanks for watching see you soon